Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends, welcome back to Rift Loopers. And today we're going to be looking at some of the customization options and stuff. As you see, you got classes, you got weapons, you got skins. So you see, these are the sort of things you can get your hands on. You can use your crystals to unlock these things. I've recently used my crystals to get some of this stuff. So obviously I've got like the ghillie suits and stuff for this particular class. Um, different weapon skins, you've got different classes. So you've got like, soldiers, medics and sappers and stuff you've got different weapons you can use for them classes there's probably gonna be more in the future um as you can see here all different ones you can use i'm gonna go through all the classes so you can see all of them and obviously as well you can get like a founders pack as well it will give you some dlc content as well which i think is pretty cool so for the sapper class you've got the grenade launcher and obviously it talks about the stats for it as well like tells you about like these damage stats and stuff how effective it is uh, different sorts of rig suits. You know, I mean, this one's more like a juggernaut skin. Uh, for the engineer, you got the pistol and the auto pistol as well. And these are sort of the, some of the sort of skins. This kind, of, what that urban's uh, corpse skin kind of reminds me a little bit of like a skin out of Destiny or something. And then for the scout, you got the marksman rifle and you got the scoped carbine rifle. And for the skins, you got standard. You got the urban stalker. Jungle Predator and the FOH DLC skin, which I think looks pretty cool. Um, as well, there's different sorts of things you can spend your, your currency on as well. So as you can see, this is where you can use some of your crystals. I've got some of my abilities unlocked so far. If you want to go the extra mile and try get all of them, guys, there's probably going to be more in the future as well. Um, so see that you can spend some of them on there. And obviously you've got challenges you can do in game as well. I've completed quite a lot of challenges throughout the time of recording these videos. I've got 8 out of 35 so far. But a lot of the challenges are going to, you know, require, um, obviously, a lot more time and effort. And so we've obviously got different difficulties and stuff on some of the challenges and stuff. And to be honest, it's, it seems like a good grind. And we've got some consumables as well you can unlock as well, like armor plates and stuff, titanium um, medic, well, titanium bones and stuff. you got all sorts of different stuff you can get. But yeah, pretty much, guys. There's a lot you can do in this game, and I, I just hope the best for the, the future for this game. I want this game to grow. I want this game to continue to do well. I'd love to see a battle pass system being implemented into this game, and different sorts of game modes, more maps, different classes, new cosmetic stuff, and be able to earn. And if you want to add in paid um, DLC, that's totally up to the developers. But I'd love to see more, more challenges and stuff. And if, like I said... When you guys see these videos, it will be past the 26th of April marker when the game is fully released. So if you would like me to make more videos on this game, let me know down below in the comment section. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, smash the thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you again next time.